dissolution wars, and particularly uh, the Siege of Sarajevo, came to Seattle and started a Balkan folk band called Culture Shock. Over the last 15 years and 30 members, Culture Shock has evolved into what uh, kids today are calling gypsy punk. A melding of, you know, myriad influences, heavy metal, punk, classic rock, Balkan folk music, traditional folk music from all over Europe, into a unique, you know, musical form. Beyond just their musical form, um, this is a band of immigrants from the Balkans who escaped political persecution and war and religious, ethnic, and nationalist um, intolerances. Uh, these are people that have seen true oppression, war firsthand in their hometowns. And they have such an uplifting message message of healing, of unity, uh, unity through diversity, uh, which is something we very much need in this country at this point. But in the mid-2000s, after they'd been touring Europe for a while, uh, playing Spain first and then in Germany and gaining a toehold in Europe, they were able to go back to their homeland, uh, the Balkans. So Slovenia, Croatia, Serbia, Bosnia, uh, Macedonia, Montenegro, uh, Bulgaria, and bring this message to these people. Current incarnation of the band is Juno Yevdovich, Val Kiesowski, Amy Denayo, Paris Hurley, Chris Stromquist, and Guy Davis. What's fascinating about this band is if you've ever seen any of the footage of them from Europe, and I hate to say it, if you're in the United States, chances are you haven't. <laughs> The people of their homeland, who are still plagued by ethnic, religious, and nationalist uh, tensions, eat this up. The younger generations are very, very, very willing and open-minded enough to listen to this message of all of the borders that we have created culturally, religiously, ethnically, they're all artificial, and these borders need not confine us as people interacting with one another. The purpose of this Kickstarter campaign is to get me on the road with the band for several weeks this summer um, in the Balkans and Europe at large. I'm not out to make a cheesy behind the scenes um, marketing video for the band uh, to sell more records for them. I'm interested in the stories of the people in the band, past and present, but more importantly, I need to see the band interacting with, entertaining, and educating their fans in Europe. Um, they love their fans, they love their homeland, and they want to see this strife, this artificially created strife, come to an end. And. In this day and age in America, where we're becoming completely uh, polarized and divisive in our political and um, social discourse, I think this message is vitally important. So please, help out with anything you can. Every little bit helps. Uh, without me getting on the road to Europe with them, I don't have a documentary, and this is Kickstarter, so it's all or nothing. Either we raise it, and I have a documentary, or we don't, and no one will get to see this. Um, so please, every little bit helps. Um, please tell your family, friends, coworkers, random people on the street. Um, every little bit helps, and to help spread the message. So please, um, if you want to see this documentary happen, um, do what you can, give what you can, and spread the message. <laughs>